Hey folks, welcome back to the Video Gadgets Journal and I need to start this one with an apology because in my previous video I was telling you how to get video from a new source but that source has immediately stopped working. It was the Mojo installer that I suggested you download and then you would be able to search through the apps, find a video towards the bottom of the page and then install it but no sooner had I done the video that the certificate from this location got revoked and so if you try and install it nothing will happen. If I tap install now probably in about two or three minutes time I'll get a pop-up saying whether I want to install it from a source and it won't actually do anything when I try that and it'll probably happen in this video at some point. Anyway there is another location and it's a location I have shown you previously but forgotten about and it still works and credit must go to steve underscore pi123 who reminded me of this link so I'm going to show you what it is again. If you go to Safari I will put the link in the description but it's mios.haimawan.com and then you need to put in some extra bits to search for video in particular and then you can download it from this source. Now although it does look as if it's in uh, Chinese or Japanese, if you tap on the blue install button that should put it on your device and it will be the English version of it. So we'll just wait for it to download there and it should take a couple of minutes and once it is ready then you'll get the usual problem of a certificate not being trusted but this certificate as I record does work. So if you go to settings Scroll down to the bottom, Profile and Device Management, pick your certificate, tap on the blue words, the red trust button, and that should get us into video for this particular demonstration, which it does. Okay, so I've done a bit more testing on video, and here are some essentials to get your recordings actually working. The first thing I recommend doing is make sure you tap Device Audio, iPad Microphone, and Device Screen and then keep track files and for the first recording you do you have to consider it a dud but it just won't work because when it does this first recording it's sorting out all its permissions so if I get it to start and I'll just correct the orientation let's go to my desktop and start the recording the very first thing it does is ask you whether you want microphone access, which you do. And then once you finish a recording, which I'm going to do a very quick recording of, just some screen swipes, it will ask you whether you want to access the photo gallery. So it's asked me whether I want to use the photo gallery, which I do. And then I can finish a recording. I'm not sure if it will be in the photo gallery, let's see, it has put it in there, so this particular one did work, and as you can see, it's now asked me whether I want to install video from the previous source, Mojo, which was about five minutes ago, so you can see that that's not quite working at the moment, but it is probably a location you want to put in the back burner, just in case it does start working and this certificate gets revoked. This is a game we have to play with it applications that need certificates. There's all sorts of locations, some certificates work, some don't, so you just have to essentially wait, see and try all the different sources as you know them. Okay, so once you've done your, I guess you would call it test recording, now you can do your next proper recording. So I will start a second recording, keep all the settings the same. I'll start it up. So now it's recording and I'm going to go into Clash of Clans this time just to show you that even though I have the speakers on you can't hear any sound and this is because it's recording the sound internally on the device so it will have the sound but it won't have it until the post video rendering and because I have the iPad audio on as well, the microphone audio, it will record what I'm saying as well sounds a bit weird and complicated but this is what's going to happen so I will stop the recording now go to my photo gallery and we should see the new recording here and with any luck when I play it we should be able to hear the audio so that's the audio that's coming from the game and it's all synced nicely but it doesn't have my speaking audio from the microphone and that's because it's actually stored within video itself. If you go to the application, 
then go to files and it's this second audio recording which has been what I was talking previously over when I was recording a video. So the idea is, if you want to combine, say, some game commentary, some live commentary that you were doing on a video, along with the pure audio that's being recorded in the background, then you can put them together in the application. Now, obviously, this isn't ideal for everyone, because you want to hear the game noises when you're playing it. And there is no perfect solution yet. No recorder has been able to record the sound internally as a pure audio recording but also output it to the speakers and I think that's what everybody's wanting in an iOS screen recorder. So that's a very basic guide to using video and of course this is a very basic guide on how to get video until of course the certificate gets revoked from that location as well and we'll have to wait for it to be fixed. So that's to try and rectify the mistake I made last night when unfortunately the Mojo installer worked as I was doing a recording, but then as soon as I uploaded the video, it stopped working. But it's one of those things with iOS screen recorders. If you have any questions, do pop them in the comments below and I'll try and answer them as best I can. Otherwise, thank you very much for watching. Enjoy the rest of your tech day. Bye for now.